Uh, hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Arclock Cluster. Uh, in this episode, we're taking a pack of rhino, hence an narcotics and bug repellent. I was gonna say I don't have berries, but we're using bug repellent. At least I hope they do take bug repellent, that's not just a mobile thing. Okay, it's also a mantis. Oh, we could take a mantis as well. Not in this episode though. Are they coming for me? Yeah, attack a pack of rhinos. Anyway, I'm going to start off with Trank Arrows and just see if we can knock them out with Trank Arrows. Oh. I can't watch the 145 die. No, 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 no. Yeah, I can, I can attack now. Please tell me that's 145. Okay, it is. How damaged are you? You're not that bad. Now, if I show you with an arrow, you'll die before you tame. Bro, they just knocked out right there and then. Yeah, I'm gonna have to use darts, but it's fine. It doesn't take that many darts. In fact, it should only take one more. Which I th could theoretically use an arrow for, but I won't. Now, what I didn't check is if I have enough narcotics. Yeah, I really didn't check how many narcotics I would need. Which is a bit of a foolish mistake. What? I was told you need four. Oh, that's, that's bullying is what that is. Anyway, we might go to like, some caves in the island soon. And maybe set up a base on the island. I feel like that's something we should probably get to doing. Anyway, I was looking for some high level shadow main. Because basically for fish basket we're allowed to tame a fish with a fish basket and keep it. Then we're allowed to tame other fish with a fish basket. And then we get two shadow main tames, one with saber to salmon and one with Kulkanth. Anyway, we have our packet right now. Leave any suggestions. We're just gonna go straight back to base because I've never actually taken the back right now. And I wanna know if I have a saddle for it to see what it's like. Uh, I am sorry that I took your friend. Here. Oi! Don't damage me with my own sorcery. I gotta let you live. Well, let's go before I get killed by a shadow main. Oh god, it's all the way over here. Pew. I'm actually gonna get him to love the Astrodal Fist. And I'm getting a bit more used to the controls. I'm still not a huge fan. Will I use it over the Rock Drake and Phoenix? Maybe. Maybe the Rock Drake. I'm as, but I am actually quite excited for a Rock Drake because they are quite powerful. Also, it will be imprinted. And I'll definitely get to taming a phoenix. I want to do that soon. Well, this is what episode eight, episode nine. I do want to take. I did say I wanted to tame the Rexes before episode ten. But honestly, I don't think we need to. I just want to go over to Aberration Ten Two Aber Megalos. Yeah, I just want to tame Aber Megalos before I go over to. And I'll come back over to this map and start breeding them. Oh, we also got a female gacha after last episode. It's 
That's uh, not bad. The male had better crafting skill. And they both had organic polymer uh, for producing. But I set one to organic polymer. Also, we wanted him in Noglinson. Yeah, I set one to organic polymer and another to, I think, oil. Also, I cannot get through here. Hello, Seekers. I actually can't get out of here. Right, okay. I'm pretty sure it's a metal and crystal biome. I thought it was muted gel, so I was like all excited. Also, spyglass is bubbling in the sky. Is there an Astra Cetus nearby? Can we tame an Astra Cetus this series, or is that an element tame? I can't actually remember. I've never tamed an Astra Cetus. I have no idea how to. Also, I'm going to tame a Titanosaur. And then I'm going to tame one of the three Titans over on Extinction. So let me know which one to tame. Probably the Desert Titan, so I could build a base on its back. Because that would be fun. Also, okay, this guy is not obeying my controls anymore. Anyway, here's our base over here. Just there. Oh my god, just point at it. There. Is that a forge? It's loaded in. No. On we go to land. Do I need water? No, I don't. I need to eat, if anything. Oh. Okay. Cosmo, stay. Packy Rhino. Oi, Cosmo. Ugh. This little annoying pest. Alright, the Packy Rhino, let's put it here. I don't know if I have an ascendant, uh, no, I said that just a Pachyrino saddle pre made. Oh, we do have a Calicotherium ascendant one that we will definitely use when we constitute the Pachyrino. I mean, the uh, Calicotherium. Anyway, we have the Pachyrino saddle. Boom. So, you have the stamina drain attack. Wait, you have. You have a passenger seat? Never knew that. Okay, so you got the passenger seat, you got stamina gray Jane. Harvest settings. Modify ordering groups, uh no. Passenger seats options Access inventory. Can you or can you not gather berries? You're not as fast as a Maywing, so we're definitely not going to use you for gathering berries if you can. But yeah, we really just tend the back around because we can. And you can gather berries. In fact, you have quite a big area of attack. Or area of effect, I think is what it's called. Oh, that's the letdown right there. Hold on, let me just level you up. Ah, uh, what is the? Wait, you don't, you don't reduce the berries. But, oh, yeah, it's nice to have, I guess. Oh, I made a ton of narcotics for this, I'm so mad. Because last time I tried to tame a Packy Rhino on mobile, I guess it's mobile, it doesn't have the same. Die, you stupid 
you're not going into a fight. Mainly because I know you'll just flee, yeah. Yeah, the last time I tried to take a fight, I was on mobile. Anyway, yeah, so that's back here right now, I guess. This is definitely the old trike running, right? The old trike running animation. Anyway, uh, let's just grab the knocker berries. I'll let you keep the seeds. Also, I want to get greenhouse set up soon. Just chuck this into here. Yeah, here's all the element dust, which really just converts to three element, and then we also have 23 element plus whatsoever in your inventory because we had to take some to extinction. And I just realized I never even used it all, but I never trans kept count of how much I had to transfer back. So it looks like I'm not transferring any element back. And we could put it in here. We can put a bug repellent back in here. Oh, I got all the stuff from the terminal again, by the way. And in terms of enforcer, I did get an enforcer, another enforcer uh, blueprint, the level 135. But honestly, I feel like I have to keep looking. Also, does the sticky mollock work? Saddle, uh, sticky mollock, not the sticky mollock, packy rhino, no, stick, yeah, striaka. Work on the packy rhino, or does it just work on the trike? Anyway, I'm gonna get you guys breeding again. I kinda hope it does work. It doesn't. Oh. Well, that's a shame, I'll probably transfer that over to any uh, future series that we have. If I did do another series in arc, which definitely will. Anyway, let's pet Ron. Yaw. And Rogue. Oh, you're a good dog. Definitely not you. Wait, what? You're a great dog. Who's that? Oh, it's a necklace. Well, anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode, I think. Wait, no, it's only 12 minutes, never mind. I guess all the fun stuff for this episode. Right, we tamed the Packy Rhino. We've tamed Gatchas. We've tamed the National Delphus. We've tamed a Maywing. G'day, Survivor. Ready for adventure? Right, Azul, Armor, and Tinto. Element. Stone. Thatch structures. Uh, bug repellent. Uh, rare flowers and petting. See, so yeah, I've not used any raw meat for tames. Meaning, I think I do want to go over to aberration soon, but this next episode not too soon to go to aberration because I can't bring any of my items with me. Well, I mean, I can, but I can't immediately just go to like a terminal like a cannon of extinction. Hmm. <laughs> I do want to go to Wyvern, but I think in order to help me on Aberration, I'm going to have to tame a creature on land. Also, I got an Ascendant Megalosaurus, Megalosaurus uh, saddle. I thought it was better than that, but yeah, we have two. And as you know, we're taming a male and female Megalosaurus. We're also taming a male and female Rex. So, yeah, we've got two Ascendant Saddles for them. Now, of course, we're going to need blueprints so that I can get, make saddles for a whole army. Gestation. Anyway, um... Yeah, so I'm really not sure as to what we do first. I'm going to put these in smithy for now. 
I'm not sure how to go about doing things. I can't. I think we'll take a Rex first. But I've recorded four episodes today, so I'm not going to record any more today. It's pitch black outside. It's only half nine. Yeah, actually, it's only half nine, but I'm also busy tomorrow, but it's fine because I have like four days worth of videos. Who's your good boy, Rogue? Rogue's my real life dog, by the way. Honestly, with you, this series, you'd think this is a no anger challenge. Oh, wait, I don't know if I got this on camera, but I did get Cosmo up to uh, 1000 weight. So we're now focusing on getting the health to about 1000. I might take Cosmo on a bit of a leveling up journey off camera. Okay, that's the baby born. You can tell by a slight lag spike. To 16. Also has really nice colours. And the good thing about oh I've not fixed my breed uh, my breeding sp uh, settings. I only fixed the mating interval and the uh, egg hatch speed. I know I'm just gonna name you Perfect F just because you have the good crafting skill and that's all I really need. So P F. No, wait, what? I can just... There we go. Anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. So, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys all in the next... Wait a second. The next episode. Oh. What the? That's not the feeding trough. What's... Wait, I'm so... What's this the range of? Um... Slightly confused. Is it the range that... You know how gachas don't like being near other gachas? Is this the range? Because wait, what? They would be in the middle, wouldn't they? Visible confusion. Yeah, it's not. What's this from? Maybe if I really logo will fix. Anyway, yeah, that is going to be the, it for this episode. So, thanks for watching. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye. Oh.